Hey, what's going on guys? Log.zip here and welcome back to Only One Command and welcome back to the Minecraft Superhero Command. Now, Only One Command is Minecraft 1.8 series where I showcase two amazing command block creations that only require one command block to be added to your Minecraft world and today's superhero is Deadpool. Loved by most, hated by some, a witty character. Very personality driven there's a zombie right behind me if you add deadpool command to your world you're gonna be given a sweet katana a nice pistol to take out any zombies that are trying to come at you uh but the katana is gonna be more than you see that knockback you're also gonna be able to teleport look at this teleport around and uh obviously it gets stuck inside giant blocks of sand while you're at it. Now there are a couple other features that Deadpool has and we're gonna be covering them in this video. This was made by the Minecraft Avatar. A link to his channel is gonna be found in the description of this video for you to check out. Guys, if you wanna see more superhero commands as they come to the channel or more only one command in general, then do make sure you drop a like rating on the video. If we break 1500 likes, then I will make sure. I <laughs> That was terrible, that was terrifying. Yo, eat pistol, man, I'm just saying. Get away from me, you stupid zombie child as well. I wish we just could have been friends. Totally butchered that quote. Then like I said, please do drop a like on the video. Thanks for subscribing, by the way, for future Minecraft content, including more Only One Command. And if you have any suggestions for superheroes that are in command blocks that I have not yet covered, please do leave them in the form of a comment in the description slash comment section. Not the description, I take that back, of this video, and I'll make sure to cover them. But without further ado, let's get into the review. So now that you've decided you want to add Deadpool to your Minecraft world, you're going to need to do something first, and that is to get yourself a command block slash give at PC, O, M, M, press tab, press, and a boom, you got yourself a command block. I'm sorry, it's been a while since I've done a superhero. I'm pretty excited because Deadpool's freaking sweet, I'm just saying. Place that baby down, place this command, you'll find a link to Minecraft Avatar's video in the description of this video, and that will link you to the command you need, and then you go, oh, well, power this sucker up, and check it out, uh. Uh, uh, and now it's installed. Whoa! Hey, Tyler, thank you so much for showcasing this Deadpool. Deadpool command. <laughs> wow, your constant support and generosity is incredible. Wow, thanks to the Minecraft avatar, whose channel is also in the description of this video. You should check out this guy, he makes really cool superheroes. Anyways, if you want to get rid of the module, it's simple enough. You just right click that and the machine is gone. But we want to actually keep it in our world. Why else would I be showing this off to you otherwise? So now Deadpool is installed in your world simple as that. And now I can show you what comes. Sorry, my computer crashed. What comes next? First things first, if you want to become Deadpool, you basically need to contract cancer. I'm sorry. Listen, it's part of Deadpool's lore. Cancer's no laughing matter, but you need to inflict yourself with cancer in Minecraft if you want to get yourself Deadpool's abilities. Because like I said, he's got it. And that's kind of part of his healing process. So, you're going to need a couple things. You're going to need to grab yourself a pork chop, meat, which I guess gives you cancer. You're also going to need to grab yourself a piece of charcoal, specifically charcoal. It's supposed to represent smoking. Gives yourself cancer. And then finally, you're going to need to get yourself a potion of weakness. However, you cannot use the potion of weakness found in the creative menu. It has a different MBT data value involved. You have to make the potion of weakness by brewing it in a brewing stand. Now, to make yourself a potion of weakness, you're going to need a brewing stand. You're going to need a water bottle. You're going to need to put the water bottle in here as well as a nether wart, which will eventually turn into an Awkward potion, shabba doo shabba dee, and then leave that baby in there. Grab yourself a fermented spider eye. Gross. Where is this baby at? Fermented spider. Oh, I, oh, it's in the brewing tab. Fermented spider eye. Put that baby in. Let that brew as well. And then finally, you will have acquired the appropriate version of the potion of weakness. Throw all three of these suckers on the ground. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> And that happens. What is that, you ask? Well, it's quite simple. It's uh, it's cancer. It's cancer cells. Terminal cancer will cause death. We're gonna go to game mode zero here, so you can see what's about to happen. This is this is just terrible. Actually, I'll tell you one thing. Hold on a second. I really didn't feel like having to make another one of those uh, once I die here, so I went ahead and did that. And we're gonna go ahead and spawn point. So we appear right here to activate the cancer. Well, it's simple. You put it right in the middle slot of your inventory, and you'll slowly start to die. Wither, nausea, and blindness will inflict you. You go, whoa, that looks kind of creepy to be honest. And <laughs> nice. And eventually, you will die of cancer. 
And uh, and that's the end of the video. Thanks for watching. Just kidding. You're gonna need to actually agree to some legal documents before you get the Deadpool effect. Now, like I said earlier, I'm not gonna sit here and pretend I know the full Deadpool lore. I'm just here showing you that Deadpool exists in Minecraft. But I believe essentially he has cancer that's going to completely kill him, the guy that is Deadpool. And the government says, you know, we can make you stronger, but you need to sign all these legal documents first. Now, the legal documents in this command are going to represent the following items. Nine pieces of paper and a nether star. So, drop all nine pieces of paper on the ground, uh, uh, and you'll get yourself a little book. Now, this book is the Weapon X File Top Secret. This is basically what they're going to use on you to turn yourself into Deadpool. Once again, we're going to go to game mode zero here. Not aim mode, but game mode zero. Place the Weapon X file in the ninth slot of your hotbar down here. If it's anywhere else, it's not going to work. And then finally, once again, place the cancer cell right in the middle. But instead of dying this time, you have become Steve for half a second. And then you've become Deadpool. Now, Deadpool comes with Speed 2, Saturation 2, Jump Boost 2, and every once in a while, a nice regen feature. Now, the regen feature that just happens randomly is supposed to represent the fact that Deadpool's cells are constantly regenerating. So every once in a while, you know, you're going to just get a quick boost of health. It's going to bump you back up to where you need to be. In addition, you are given some unique abilities once you become Deadpool. First of all, you're given a nice katana. Now, before I carry on any further, I did forget to mention that all the unique items that comes with the Deadpool command also comes with quotes from Deadpool, both from the comic books, I believe, as well as the movie. Now, Deadpool is a very character-driven superhero. You're supposed to like him. He's supposed to be a, a bad A, if you get it. He's supposed to be a big mo, a bad, a bad, I can't say, a bad mother, okay? He's supposed to be a bad mother. He's supposed to be cool and, like, you want to be him and he's hip and he's a hit with all the ladies or something like that. I don't know. That's what I'd like to be. Therefore, it's personality-driven, so all his items come with special quotes. First one here is, my common sense is tingling. That's supposed to be a jab at Spider-Man because apparently Spidey senses are like really just common sense. Now over here we got a quote directly from the movie. If you've seen the Deadpool trailer, you may be wondering why the red suit? That's so bad guys can't see me bleed. <laughs> good one. Good one, Deadpool. Once my TV didn't work, so I kicked it. It started working. Oh, thank goodness. No one wants a broken TV. And wow, tell me that's not just a beautiful sky. I'm sorry, I'm, get, I'm getting distracted. Now, again, you got the quotes on here as well. Katana, sharpness 10, knockback 5, unbreakable. Pretend these sharp sticks aren't swords and hop on. Another quote from Deadpool. You got the pistol, which is a, supposed to be like a gun that you can throw as a snowball. Get rabies, corporate vampire. Uh, I don't even know how he says any of these things. And then you've got the teleporting ability. Smells like somebody just teleported a bean burrito. Uh, Minecraft Avatar said that that is a quote directed at Nightcrawler, I believe. Now, I gotta switch difficulty. Oh, I guess difficulty's on. We got our first target. Now, the sword is just a super strong sword. Now, the pistol, you can literally just fire off, and it gives a nice cool parlo effect. Parlo, parlo I said. <laughs> it's been a long day. Leave me alone. And basically, if you hit a mob with it, it's gonna do damage to them, as well as cause a nice wither effect. Uh, uh. And you actually only need to hit near them. You don't actually have to hit the mob itself, and eventually... Now finally, the teleporter will teleport you 25 blocks in whatever direction you're looking. So with any luck, we'll appear fairly close to these mobs over here. Yeah, pretty, pretty, pretty close. Check it out, check it out, check it out. The other neat thing about Deadpool, which you'll see right here, is no fall damage. Uh, uh. And he's got a nice little jump boost so you can climb up these things faster. Now again, we're going to teleport back to these mobs. Take them out with the katana. Now the other neat thing about Deadpool is every once in a while, once you kill enough mobs or fire your pistol off, sorry, I'm tripping on my words, enough times you'll actually start to see additional quotes from Deadpool. So we're going to kill a couple mobs. Uh, uh, nice one shot. Uh, come on. Yeah, dead. So we're going to kill a couple of these suckers. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, come on. Now again, you have to either kill mobs with the sword or fire off your pistol. They'll both slowly start to add up to different amounts of quotes. Now I believe once you've either killed 18 mobs or fired off your pistol or some combination of the two, a total of 18 times, you'll see your first quote. So we go and try, yeah, see, I wish we could have just been friends as he attacks and kills 
poor innocent zombies. I guess they're not poor or innocent because they don't have any money and they're also evil. Now I believe the next quote is around, what was it? I think it's 37 kills, I think? 37 kills or 37 fires off of your pistol. The teleporter is hype. You gotta be careful with the teleporter though because you can actually get stuck in walls. See, just boom, boom. But you can teleport right outside of them if that ends up happening. Now I actually wanna show you the way the health works here. You'll take damage every once in a while though, uh, I mean, 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 uh, you'll get basically all your health back. Oh, jeez. I Whoa, that was super close. Now, you actually don't really come with too much armor. The armor is very low, so you can die as Deadpool, especially if you're on difficulty level of three, which is hard mode. You can start getting work, to be honest. Like, look at these guys. They have them, they wear with me. So you gotta make sure that you're ready for your regen to work. Other, You see? Boom. Back up to full health. Let's get the heck out of here. They're giving us a bad time. Well, you can literally... Whoa! Nice ability to fly, kind of. Super interesting. That's really neat, actually. So you can basically fly with Deadpool. Probably not what you're supposed to do with it, but, you know, it's fun all the same. Look at that. That's insanity. Huh, and you have no fall damage, you don't gotta worry about nothing. Okay, so let's go ahead and activate the rest of these quotes. I'm probably just gonna fire off the pistol because that's gonna be the fastest way. I think once we get to 38, let me see. Now the cool thing is if you hit a snowball near the mob, but not actually at the mob, it will still cause them to get the effect, and that's actually gonna allow you to hit multiple mobs at once. See, I think we can hit it. See, look, look how many we just affected with one shot. Talk about some burst fire on that pistol, baby. You stole my last cheesy puff. I believe he says this to his friend Weasel, which we're also gonna be covering in just a second here. But I wanna get that last quote going in strong. Oh, you won't come at me? Not today, not today. Your teleporters are so much fun. Every time, man, every time. Now, I'm gonna let him blow me up. Oh, I, okay, well that was bad. <laughs> he actually ended up killing me. Man, I gotta make all the stupid cancer cells again. <sighs> Gosh, that took forever. Once again, potion of weakness. Get yourself that raw pork chop. Throw it on the ground. Throw it on the ground. Not the cooked pork chop. The raw one, man. Not the coal. The charcoal, man. Get that. Put it right back in there. You're once again Deadpool. Not sure if the quotes reset. I guess the fastest way to check is just to fire these off like crazy. Again. Oh. Whoa. Okay. Well, that is probably either an unintended effect or slash command. Or he is legitimately concerned about that last cheesy pup. There's that final quote, and please don't mind the ridiculously loud barking dogs outside my window. Hopefully you can't even hear them, but I hear them. They are in my ear right now. Now give me all your lunch money. That's what I say to you, because I'm Deadpool, and I'm uh, I'm friendly. Just kidding. I kind of suck personality-wise, but I'm also cool, so it makes up for it. See? Lesson learned here. If you're really funny, you can get away with being a jerk. I'm just saying. Don't be a jerk though, it's me. Now, one thing to note about the Deadpool character is you can't actually lose these items. You try and drop the katana, you get the katana right back. You try and drop the pistol, you get, oh. Or you clone them. Either way, you can't actually get rid of them. When you try and throw it, you get another one instantly. Same with the teleporter, all that stuff. That is intended effect. So don't worry too much about it, friend. Whoa, nice. Seriously, the teleporter is all the hype right now. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that's so cool. Anyways, whatever. Oh my gosh! I didn't mean to look at you! <laughs> that was so scary. Okay, so let me show you the last effect. Basically, we're gonna summon... Uh-oh. Where's he at? Where's he at? Whatever. I ain't gonna worry too much about it. We're gonna summon in a villager. Anytime Deadpool is near a villager, the villager will turn into a nice little friend here. But you need to have some gold nuggets on you as well. You need five gold nuggets. And once you have the five gold nuggets, you can bring them to your dear friend. Come on, work with me here. Actually, it, you might need to spawn him in with a spawn egg. I'm not entirely sure. It was supposed to work, man. Now you're just embarrassing me. Oh, there you go. You right click him and you got the nuggets on you. Or maybe not even. And he'll turn into Deadpool's friend, Weasel. Now, Weasel's real neat because he sells a chimichanga. Now, this must be some kind of inside joke that I don't understand that has to do with Deadpool. But essentially, you get, you get, you get chimichanga. Now let's see how this works. Now, do you even need to have the gold nuggets? We're about to find out. Maybe if you just right click him. Okay, so he just turns into weasel. He will no longer make noise. He will stand still. He won't be able to move anymore. And he will trade you that chimichanga. So we all get it from this one because that's only fair. We were gonna give this guy the gold first. Now, I don't really even know that this does much of anything or if it's just like a fun little 
<laughs> you know what I mean? Because you're not losing any hunger when you're Deadpool, obviously. And uh, I don't know. I just felt like telling you about that. Now, the final thing I should know is there is one way to get rid of these items, and that is to remove any of Deadpool's armor. You'll see, like I said, you can't get rid of these. You try and get rid of them. You're just going to get a bunch of this happening. Bada boom, bada bing. But if you remove any piece of Deadpool's armor, they will disappear immediately. And if you try and pick up any of these while you are missing a piece of Deadpool's armor, they will all disappear right away. Does not matter what piece of armor you remove, all of them result in you losing your items as well as your special effects. But the moment you put it all back on again, you're gonna get it all back once more. Now, if there's one thing I'd love to see added or changed to the Deadpool command is that perhaps it can be remade in 1.9 to use dual wielding which Deadpool is known for. He's got his dual wielding katanas as well as his dual wielding pistols. But Minecraft Avatar, what a gentleman. He decided he wanted to make it for 1.8, so perhaps he'll update it for 1.9. He just wanted to make sure it was compatible with the rest of his superhero commands. But all the same, if you want to add Deadpool to your world and be your very own Deadpool superhero in Minecraft, you'll be able to find a link to Minecraft Avatar's video, which has the link to the command in the description of my video. So big thank you to him. Again, his channel is also linked below. Check out his stuff. Thanks so much for watching this Superheroes Only One Command. If you want to see more superhero commands as they come out, as more people make them, then let me know by dropping a like rating on the video for me break 1,500 likes, and I'll make sure to make some more superhero command reviews as they come out. Once again, thank you so much for subscribing for future Minecraft content, including more Only One Command and more superhero commands. Hope you have a great day. Enjoy Deadpool. He's a lot of fun, and we'll see you later.